One of the special cases that exists when we are graphing a system of two equations and two variables is parallel lines. This video will illustrate what this looks like when using the graphing method to solve. It is assumed that you know how to graph a straight line using a table of values. I am going to start by graphing equation 1 and I will start by finding the intercepts. If x is equal to 0, y is equal to 5. If y is equal to 0, x is equal to 5. And if x is equal to 2, y is equal to 3. In the equation on the right, equation 2, if x is equal to 0, y is equal to negative 2. If y is equal to 0, x is equal to negative 2. And if x is equal to 2, y is equal to negative 4. Take your time doing this to make sure you get it right and show your algebra. Now it is time to graph the lines. Starting with equation 1, I am going to put a point at 0, 5. I will put a point at 5, 0. And I will put a point at 2, 3. Drawing a line through these three points, my graph looks like this. With equation 2, I am putting points at 0, negative 2, negative 2, 0, and 2, negative 4. I draw a line through these three points, and my graph looks like this. Now we can see that these lines are parallel, and therefore the solution set is no solution. When asked for the type of lines, we give the answer parallel lines. There is no solution to a system of equations that are parallel because these lines will never cross, so it is impossible for us to give a point that they hold in common. This is what parallel line solution will look like when solving a system of equations in two variables using the graphical method. 